Okay, time is 6 p.m. and the floor plan is on commission. Come to order. Roll call. Danny Wiley. Present. Charlie Ramirez. Here. Jonathan Larga. Romeo Robles. Rafael Munguia. Andy Castro. Present. Ruben Luna. Here. Mercedes Guillen. We have a quorum. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Chair. I'll make a motion to excuse absentees. A second. All those in favor say aye. Aye. All those opposed, same sign. Okay, motion carries. Public testimony. Anybody signed up? No one signed up, Mr. Chairman. Okay, we'll go on to approval of the minutes of March the 25th, 2024. Mr. Chairman, I move to approve the minutes. I'll second. Okay, all those in favor say aye. 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 All those opposed, same sign. Okay, the motion carries. Public hearing. Good evening, Laura Fonseca, Planner 2 for the City of Far. And uh, tonight we ha I have five items for your recommendation. Um, the first of five items, we I would make a recommend. I would like to um, make a recommendation to untable that items first. Mr. Chairman, I'll make a motion to untable. A second. All those in favor, say aye. 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 All those opposed, same sign. Okay. The motion carries. First item is Jorge Peña Architects, LLC, representing Luis Biasi, owner, has filed with the Planning and Zoning Commission a request for a change of zone from General Business District C to Heavy Commercial HC in order to develop and construct a warehouse with trailer parking. The subject site is located on the east side of South Cage Boulevard, approximately 260 feet north of East Anaya Road, and has a physical address of 8901 South Cage Boulevard. The property is legally described as being 0 0.52 acres, more or less, out of lot 356, Kelly Far Subdivision, Far Hidalgo County, Texas. The property front South Cage Boulevard, a 120 to 150 foot principal arterial street, which runs north and south with a posted speed limit of 40 to 55 miles per hour, as identified in the City of Far Thoroughfare Plan. The property was rezoned from Agricultural and or Open Space District AO to General Business District C and Single Family Residential District R1 on August 16th, 2005. The property to the north was rezoned from Agricultural and or Open Space District AO to Limited Industrial District LI on December 19th, 2006. The property to the south and east were zoned Agricultural and or Open Space District AO upon annexation on October 3rd, 1989. The property to the west was rezoned from Agricultural and or Open Space District AO to Limited Industrial District LI on April 10th, 2012. There have been no other zoning requests within the vicinity of this subject property since that time. The property is generally designated for commercial use in the land use plan. <coughs> the heavy commercial district HC is established to provide adequate space and site diversification for commercial establishment, which would involve influences that would be objectable in the other commercial districts or adjacent to residential districts. Included in this district are commercial use that involve large volumes of truck traffic, outside operations, and storage of materials and equipment, either for sale or as part of the business. Excessive noise from heavy space operations or any other possible blinding influences. The district is commercial in nature but has some aspects that are similar to industrial uses. The noise, traffic, litter, late night hours, outside storage of material and equipment and other possibly blighting influences require ad adequate buffering. Three letters were mailed out to the surrounding property owners within a 200 foot radius on March 8, 2024 and a legal notice was published in the Advanced News Journal on March 6, 2024. At previous meeting, two uh, people were voicing their concerns with regards to the traffic congestion or the high traffic with semi-trailers. 
<coughs> staff is recommending disapproval of the request to rezone from general business district C to heavy commercial district HC as the property is not compatible with nearby commercial uses and may have detrimental impact on the area. East Anaya Road is currently a two lane roadway which measures 25 feet in wide and would not be able to withstand the traffic with the development which the development is proposing. If approved, the owner must comply with all city ordinances and city department requirements. Um, and for the record, there's no representation. This item is to go before city commission meeting on April 15th, 2024 at 4 p.m. Okay, this item requires a public hearing. Is there anybody from the affected area signed up to speak on this item? No one signed up, Mr. Chairman. Okay, we'll close the public hearing and open up the item of board discussion. Okay. Well, Mr. Chairman, um, I'd like to go into executive session. Okay. City of Far Plain zoning hereby gives notice that it may meet in closed session, executive session to discuss the following items. Time is 6.07.